earlier you asked the question, how optimistic must we be? And at first I was thinking maybe the word is guided optimism. But then um, listening to, to everyone here, I thought that maybe the word to use is conditional optimism rather than guided optimism. Meaning it's optimism that is conditional on having a plan and uh, conditional on actually implementing that plan. So if we don't have a plan for moving forward, um, that optimism will just uh, get thrown out of the window. So that's where I am today. Um, if you ask me, uh, what are the three top things that we must uh, work on? In other words, what would be the key elements of that plan? Um, first, I would say, and I'm sure everyone will agree with me, we need an efficient vaccine rollout. Let's do it as fast as we can, scale it up as fast as we can. Um, in other words, uh, uh, address problems on logistics, address problems on vaccine hesitance, etc. Number two is um, having learned from our lockdown policy last year, I think we need to calibrate our lockdown policy. Clearly, with the surge in uh, new cases, um, we're going back to our what, July, August levels. Um, inevitable of lockdown, but we need to have a better lockdown policy, meaning a localized lockdown policy rather than a national um, blanket lockdown. Mm -hmm. And it has to be localized. It has to be at the barangay level. There has to be clinical triggers, meaning we have to ask our friends here, our doctor friends, um, if, if an LGU breaches, for example, X new cases per thousand population, sorry, you have to be MECQ. Or if you breach Y new cases per thousand population, sorry, ECQ. Or if you improve then you go back to MECQ and so forth and so on. So I think we need that. And so wala nang, um, I remember there were situations when the mayors had to, had to actually vote on whether they would have a stricter lockdown or not. I don't think they should be subject to voting. It has to be subject to epidemiological triggers. Mm. So I think that's where our experts can come in. Mm. Number three, no lockdown, whether it's a scaled up lockdown or a localized lockdown. No lockdown will work without cash assistance. Why? Mm. Rohobi, mm. Cheryl, most mm. of our workers are no work, no pay yeah. workers. So if they're locked down at home, gutom yan. Mm. Walang pakaka ipapakain sa pamilya. Um, and more importantly, kung nagkasimpamas ka ng COVID, naka-lockdown ka, magpapakwarantine ka ba? Knowing that if you go to a quarantine facility, then you miss out on uh, earning and feeding your family. So, mm. kailangan talaga ng increased government spending. And that's mm. the reason for why I never stop pushing for more government spending. I, I never stop pushing yeah. for economic stimulus. I